All right, good day everyone. So welcome back to my channel, Catholic and Vlogs. And this time we'll talk about special products. So this is College Algebra. So we have here special products that will be presenting to you the special product. So this is quantity of A plus B times the quantity of A minus B is equal to A squared minus B squared. Take note of these special products. So quantity of a plus b squared is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. Quantity of a minus b squared is equal to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Next is x, the quantity of x plus a, x plus b is equal to x squared plus a plus b quantities x plus ab. All right, so we have here, the next is Quantity of AX plus B times the quantity of CX plus D is equal to ACX squared plus the quantity of AD plus BC X plus BD. Next is quantity of A plus BC quantity squared is equal to A squared plus B squared plus C squared plus 2AB plus 2AC plus 2PC. So take note of the special products. I will be presenting to you example for each special product for you to be able to grasp how to use these special products. So let us have write out the special products. So let us have example letter A. So the special product of this one is this. So this is in the form A plus B plus C and this is A plus B minus C. So this is in the form of A plus B and A minus B is equal to A squared minus B squared. So take note of this one A squared minus B squared. So this part this is our A this part and this is our B. So to get the special product of this one, just have this product because this is the form of A plus B, A minus B. So therefore, A squared minus B squared. What is our A? Our A is A plus B. This squared. What is our B? Our B is C, right? C. So minus C then square. So this is the special product of this part. Get it? Okay. For this is number one. For number two, we have x plus 3y and we have x minus 3y. So same way with this one, this is a special product of in the form of a plus b and this is a minus b is equal to a squared minus b squared okay so we have here our a is x and our b is equal to 3y so we have here a a squared minus b squared so therefore our a here is x then squared minus b which is 3y squared so therefore, we have here x squared minus 9y squared. Okay, so this is the special product for number 2. So we have here number 3. So number 3 we have in the form of x plus 5 and x minus 5. Alright, so this the same way with this. This is in the form of a squared minus b squared. So our a here is x and b is equal to 5. So therefore, we have here our a is x then squared minus 5 then squared. So the answer is x squared minus 25. Okay, this is 25. Okay, so this is all about this form of special product number 1. So stop, try this. Write out the products. So the quantity of the 3, quantity of x plus y, plus 5 times the quantity of 3, quantity of x plus y, 
minus 5. In number 2, we have here p plus q plus 7r and p plus q minus 7r. Take note of the trick of this one. You could rearrange or you could rechange this in order for us to fit the special product time. Okay, so let's proceed with number 4. Okay, so we are now in number 4. So in number 4, we have u plus 3v quantity squared. Okay, so u plus 3v, so this is in the form of a plus b the squared is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. So if this is our a, our a here is equal to this part. We have u and our b is 3v. So therefore, sub simply substituting here. So you have u squared plus 2 times u then 3v plus which is our b is 3v squared okay so it is u squared plus 6uv plus 9v squared so this is the type product of this one next we have here number five number five this is 3x minus 2y squared this is in the form of a minus b squared is equal to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. So our a here is, is equal to 3x. Our b is equal to negative, uh, we have 2y. So we have here 3x minus 2y is equal to our a here is 3x squared minus 2 times which is our b of 3x and this is 2y plus b which is 2y then squared so this is 9x squared minus 12xy plus 4y squared so this is the answer for number 5 which is 9x squared minus 12xy plus 4y squared so that's it for number five. So stop try this, write out the following product. So take note, you have to make the one at home. Okay, so let's proceed with number six. Number six, x plus seven, quantity, quantity of x plus times the quantity of x plus 11. So this is in the form of a number six. Number six, the form of this one is x squared plus a plus b x plus a b so x plus 7 x plus 11 so which is our a here is this and this is our b so copy paste here so x squared plus which is our a 7 plus 11 copy x plus the product of 7 and 11. So we have x squared plus 18x plus 77. So this is the answer for number 6. Okay. For number 7, same, same for this part, which is a plus this one, x squared plus a plus b x plus a b so x minus 15 and x minus 3 are a and this is r b so which is x squared plus we have a is negative 15 plus negative 3 uh, this is 15 yes 15 then copy x here plus negative 15 times negative 3 okay so negative 15 times this one x squared minus 18 x negative 15 times negative 3 that is 45 
Okay? So this is the answer, 15 and 3, 45. So that's the answer for 6 and 7. This is the form of that product, type product. This is a type product for 6 and 7. Okay, so let's proceed now with stop, try this, write out the following products. So take note of these following products, you have to familiarize with this one, because as you are going to take another mathematics, so this is very indispensable, as you take higher mathematics, for easy, for you to have an easy way of solving. Okay, so we have here number eight. In number 8, so this is in the form of, okay, so this is number 8, we have, okay, we have here A and B. So therefore, this is ACX squared plus AD plus BC, then X plus BD. Okay, why we can say that this is in the form of this part or type product? Because this, this is A and this is C. There is a C and A and C here. Okay, then we have the B and the D. So if, you have, if we're going to write this one, okay, okay. So our A here is equal to 9. Our B here is equal to, okay, this is our A negative uh, we have negative 4 RC here is okay RC ABC 7 RD is equal to negative 6 okay so just copy here AC which is a 9 times 7 x squared plus which is a times D a, which is 9 times negative 6 plus B, which is negative 4 times, which is our C, which is 7. Then copy X plus BD, which is B and D, negative 4 and negative 6. 9 times 7, which is 63 X squared plus this is negative 54 minus 28 x plus 24 so we have here 63 x squared minus 82 x plus 24 so this is the answer for number eight in number nine same process with this so we have 5x minus 2 and this is 3x plus 7 so our a here is 5 our b is negative 2 our c is 3 and d is equal to 7 so by the use of a c x squared so our a here is 5 times c which is 3 x squared plus a times d a here is 5 times d which is 7 plus b which is negative 2 times negative 2 times c which is a 3 then quantity x then plus BD, which is negative 2 times 7. Okay, so we will scratch this part. Continue here. So this is 15x squared plus 40, uh, we have 35 minus 6x minus 14 so 15 x squared this is plus 29 x minus 14 so this is the answer for number nine
Okay, so this is a way of how to use the special product. Okay, stop, try this. Try out the following product, the quantity of 4x minus 3, 10x plus 9 quantity. And 8, the quantity of 12x minus 5 and the quantity of 2x plus 25. Next, we have here number 10. In number 10, this is a, it is, is very uh, obvious that the form is a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus 2ab plus 2ac plus 2bc. So first, we are going to name this one as our a, which is 3x, b is 2y, and c is equal to z. By the use of this one, we have 3x squared plus b, which is 2y squared plus z then squared plus 2 times, which is 3x, which is b2y plus, which is 2a, 2 times 3x, which is our c, z, plus 2, our b is 2y plus, which is c, which is z. So this is 9x squared plus 4y squared plus z squared plus 3 times 2, 6, 12xy plus 6xz plus 4yz. Okay, so this is in a form of this. So this is the final answer. So stop, try this. Write out the product. So number nine. So thank you so much for tuning to this uh, Catholican Vlogs. I hope you learned something today. So God bless everyone. Do not forget to subscribe.